Well, hi, everybody, and good Tuesday morning to you, meteorologist Travis Klineski here. We've had rain overnight, especially in northern and western Nebraska, and over the last couple of hours has started to move into the Tri-Cities area. But we've been seeing this activity weaken quite a bit, and I think that trend will continue here. So as we get towards the later morning, the chances of rain get much lower for most of us as they will shift away from us. And we'll be looking at more of an isolated hit or miss thunderstorm chance this afternoon. You can see probably the best chance in eastern portions of Nebraska. Nebraska with some cloud cover clearing out some sunshine. We'll warm it up, but it won't be overly warm today. In fact, it'll probably be cooler for most of us out there. The warmest temperatures out west where the sun will be out a little longer. Heading into tonight, then more showers and thunderstorms are expected, especially out west this evening. And then later in the night, they'll shift eastward. Now, it's kind of a question mark, kind of a 50-50 question mark. Will we get rain or thunderstorms in the Tri-Cities or not? Some models don't have much like this one here. Others do bring in another round of showers and thunderstorms during the day to, or during the night tonight, late night. Continuing into tomorrow, I think we'll see more rain and thunderstorms, especially towards tomorrow afternoon and tomorrow evening. This time the focus for the better chances will be to the north, although I think we'll get some chance around the Tri-City. So I'm going to keep about that 50-50 chance going until about midnight tomorrow night. That's when the chances will then start to shift off to the east and southeast and our chances will get much lower. And for the much of the rest of the week, our chances will be much lower than what we've seen these last couple of days here, or at least for today and tomorrow. Well, I don't think we'll see much of a severe weather threat the next couple of days. Isolated severe storms possibly, but not a big time severe weather threat. Tonight, your chances will be mostly to the west and south. And then tomorrow, your chances more towards the north and east. Uh, again, very hit or miss isolated thunderstorm activity. Now, Thursday, we may still see some storms in the area, but mostly in eastern Nebraska. I don't think we'll see a big chance around the Tri-Cities here. And an isolated severe storm can't be ruled out across the northeast and east central portions of Nebraska. As I mentioned, for most of us today, temperatures will be a little bit cooler. We're looking at lower 80s up north, and that morning chance of thunderstorms winding down, partly cloudy this afternoon. Out west, same thing. We'll see those chances this morning kind of wind down, and then more, a little more sunshine working its way in this afternoon. Temperatures into the uh, mid and upper 80s for afternoon highs. As for the south, kind of low to mid-80s this afternoon. Numerous th thunderstorms are kind of winding down this morning, then more of an isolated thunderstorm chance this afternoon. Same thing to the east, chance of thunder showers this morning, and then isolated thunderstorms this afternoon, low to mid-80s for afternoon high temperatures. Next couple of days. Tomorrow, similar temperature-wise as we keep the rain in the forecast, about a 50-50 chance, then wraps up after midnight Wednesday night. Thursday, we see more heat building. This will be the hottest day from the most of us will see for at least the next seven days and possibly maybe for the rest of the month as uh, long range models are kind of hinting at us keeping comfortable, not overly hot. Uh, there still is a slight chance of rain and thunderstorms tomorrow afternoon, a little better chance tomorrow evening with a front that comes through. That front will bring temperatures back down for Friday and right through the weekend as we're back into the 80s for highs. Friday and Saturday likely going to be dry with a lot more sunshine out there. Late Saturday night into Sunday morning, there is a chance of showers and thunderstorms, a slight chance again towards Sunday night into Monday morning and another chance Monday afternoon. And uh, we'll keep things on the more comfortable side of te the temperature range as we get keep continuing to Monday of next week here. And again, as I said, long range forecast models, which again, take us through most of the rest of the month, through most of at least next week, keep us in mostly the 80s. So it's not gonna be an overly warm stretch of weather even beyond the seven day forecast. So that's the good news uh, for those that don't like the extreme heat is that we're not gonna see any of that anytime soon. Again, Thursday being the hottest day. So, so there you go. There is your forecast for today. And if you were wondering why I was looking over, I was just checking my calendar just to make sure I had my days right here. Um, as the last couple of days will be following next week here. So anyway, I uh, hope you all have a good day. Hope you enjoy the rain that we have out there right now this morning. And uh, again, this afternoon, probably not as much rain for most of you, but a couple of people might be surprised to get a few isolated showers. So hope you have a good Tuesday. Take care. God bless. Bye.